Rojas and Denton. How good can they be at dictating tempo, slowing things up, and breaking through the line of Ballard FC and for James Riley and Ballard FC defensively compactness. Both these teams ready to go. Spokane in all black and in all gold. It is Ballard FC. We are underway tonight under the lights at Memorial Stadium. Ballard FC and Spokane Velocity. He was hired back in November and had a blank canvas really to lay out what he wanted this team to look like. And a lot of experienced players is a modern. Looks in a pretty heavy challenge there. Down goes Kai Briscoe as he's shaken up a bit. Very surprising that a modern does not see yellow here. You just see no play on the ball whatsoever. Just close lines. Briscoe right in front of our center referee. I think the left back for Spokane gets away with one here. Four minutes in, yes, you want to read. Not let this game get out of control, but that's a harsh challenge for Ahmad in so early in this match. Out of the 24-year-olds, time with LA Galaxy 2 of Lake Forest, California. An early shot on here, and it's Peter Swinkles to make his first save of the game. His first appearance with Spokane. Winkles coming over from one Knoxville, who advanced into the next round of the U.S. Open Cup earlier today. The 2-0 win. Physical play here early on on both sides. Okay, quick to put it back in play. Here's Miller and Denton. Long switch of play. Headed down, and Ballard can look upfield once again. the corner challenge put in it's kept in play Ballard able to keep possession Dale Myers down the line Kingston's asking for it trying to cut this back towards the end line the cross now comes into the middle the header by Mejia and out of play Ballard working very hard to create their chances you can just see the numbers that they commit into the attacking 18-yard box. Mejia, Dale, and then you have Leatherman joining the attack. Does just enough to get away from Miller. This time's this jump. And he's been very active, the number nine for Ballard, just occupying the two center backs and also being that first line of pressure and making life very difficult. Watch out. Nearly a turnover at the back. And Ballard almost able to win this back. And it's a modern now. Another back pass, Slam Fear gets rid of this one, although couldn't find a gold shirt. Come on, playing chase. Denton had to be quick in the middle. Here's Andre Lewis. Great signing to anchor that midfield for Spokane. Experienced USL championship player is Lewis. His time with Hartford Athletic and Colorado Springs. And just trying to settle things. It's been a frantic start here at Memorial Stadium. Reedy in for Dolling. Dolling, who was part of that St. Louis City two side in the inaugural season of MLS Next Pro. And now Longmire under pressure. This Ballard team is relentless. It just seemed like they wanted just a little bit more at this moment in time. This is rolled in behind, and maybe something coming here for Ballard. Swinkle's able to make the save at the near post. Corner kick, Ballard FC. And most of their attacking opportunities have just came from the counter press, winning the ball, and more advantageous opportunity. And here it's Kingston just trying to squeak it into that near post, and Swinkle's is just enough to push it wide of his bar. But Ballard has been very good to open this match. 
They'll have a corner kick here. An in-swinging ball right on top of the goalkeeper who is in traffic. Headed for it again. And this through the uprights and it sends Cameron Miller to the turf. Hinkson will take this off the wall, way into the air. Neil trying to prevent a corner kick. He was unable to do so. It'll be another one here for Ballard. Third of the game already. And it was a comfortable distance for Kingsley just to go up and over the wall as he liked to go quick here. Comes to the top of the area and then move back out wide. Whip ball in and the header is just wide. Great chance for Demian Alvarez. Chance from distance, and much too high to test Peter Swinkles. this along Hackworth blocked down chance though for Rojas to get on the ball Rojas cutting it back gets the cross away dulling wide best chance of the game for Spokane and one of the first chances they've had today the lack of backtracking for Ballard FC you just see the dark jerseys advancing themselves into the 18 yard box Rojas does very well to create his own space we just see three black jerseys and Briscoe's the only Ballard Defender there, Josh Dolling's gonna want this one back. He should be hitting the target from about seven yards out. Brilliant ball in from Rojas. That's exactly what I was talking about, Josh, for this Ballard side. Yes, you want to play attack-minded football, but you can't leave yourself exposed going back the other way. The Spokane side has too much quality in the attacking phase of the game that they can't hurt you. Intercepts. will be no stoppage time. But as you mentioned, Ricky, this has been a quality first 45 minutes up and down. There's the whistle, and away we go for this second 45 minutes. Ballard FC and Spokane Velocity, the first ever Minnesota United. Last though, played in Belgium for RFC Serang. About a long throw here, punched away by Lamphier. And Tenere keeps his balance, defended by the Lesotho International and Lesia Thetsane. A couple of African countries there. Cleared away. Slipped in, Martin Hill wide! Still no shot on target for Spokane. Back centrally, Fernandez, from the oncoming Metanere. Cross whipped into a good area. Engman got his head to it first. Out for a throw in. Probably see a long throw for Metanair. Moments ago, we just saw the brilliance from Andre Lewis. So the second phase defending for Ballard needs to be very good here. Take it short, Fernandez back for Metanair. Whips it one in, all the way through. Dolling missed it. There's Metanair. It's got to be some of the last chances of regulation. Martin Hill blocked down. Long throw in coming for Spokane. Roman Metanair and. This has got to be it for regulation. Either somebody's scoring here or we're going to extra time. Long throw comes in. It's loose and it's in! Andre Lewis at the death! The dagger for Spokane Velocity!
First shot on target, and that is it. The referee has ended it. Spokane Velocity, their first shot on target. It's the lone goal of the night.